Well, here is that watch party we were talking about. Family and friends rooting for Jenna Prandini from halfway across the globe as she advances in the 100 meter. The group packed the house for that big watch party in Clovis. And again, as Andrew mentioned, the NBC Olympic cameras were there along with our cameras. Our AJ Cotto had a front row seat. Joins us live now, and AJ, everyone holding their collective breath for at least 11 seconds. Alex, son, yes, that's right. There is definitely plenty of support locally for her. You can see that the windows here in Old Town are painted for her. And tonight, family and friends were glued to the TV, cheering her on. <laughs> Seated halfway around the world, but cheering as if they were there. Jenna Prandini's family and friends watching her living out her dreams. She, in kindergarten, said she wanted to go to the Olympics, and she didn't know when what. She just said, I want to go to the Olympics one day. Born to compete, the former Clovis High track star in Oregon Duck making her second Olympic appearance Thursday after finishing 10th in the 200 meters in 2016. Now getting another shot, participating in the 100 and 200 meters track and field events for Team USA in Tokyo. Her parents rooting for her from home this time. Well, there's something about watching it live, you know, that would be, would be better or um, in, a, in a full stadium. But it's exciting here. Don't, don't, don't get me wrong. It's just as uh, thrilling. Former college roommate, teammate, and friend Ashante Horsley says Prandini's dedication is what sets her apart. She's extremely disciplined, more than anyone who I've ever met. And so I think that there's not very many limits to what she can accomplish. The Valley, especially in Prandini's hometown of Clovis, showing their love with painted storefronts and signs. <laughs> Prandini now advances after the opening round of the 100. Father Carlo hoping to see the momentum continue. Appreciate all the support uh, for Jenna and, and the friendship that we really have in this community. And um, send those good vibes over there. Progress. The events will be in the early morning hours at 3 a.m. and 5 a.m. She will be running her choice event, the 200, on Sunday morning. Reporting live in Clovis, AJ Cotto, KC24, Local News That Matters.